Okay, great. Just a couple of super demure outfits. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Oh. Hi guys, my name is Grace Helping Food Up. No, now you know your life is different now. I'm here with Mamrie Hart. Ooh, ooh. I kind of burped while doing it. It sounded <laughs> auto tuned. <laughs> if you guys don't know what you should know by now, because it's very much common knowledge, Mamrie and I have a podcast called This Might Get Weird. I wore my first thong bathing suit. You what? <laughs> Okay, wait, this is big news. Release every Wednesday. Mm -hmm. It's like a caged animal that gets released every Wednesday. Yes, we build it up, we poke it and we prod it and then we release it to the public. And we've evolved it so much to a point that we are now going on tour with Woo! the podcast. We are going to seven different cities. Let's see if we can remember which ones there. Denver, are. Dallas, I know double D's. Detroit. Detroit. Detroit, Phoenix, Minneapolis, Seattle, Portland, that's it. That's it. Seven cities. <laughs> Pick to live in a tour. All the links for the tickets are down in the description box below, so please go get those. Not to toot our own horns, but yeah. I feel like we cultivate an audience of really sweet, wonderful, open-minded people that all want to meet and greet each other. So I think it would behoove you to go out on a limb and do something you're uncomfortable with and maybe come to one of our shows by yourself and make some friends. You don't use behoove enough. Our podcast, a lot of it is Grace and I going on adventures and yes. I and I do a lot of those by myself. So like what oh. better time to go do something fun by yourself than the podcast that celebrates that. You can start your own podcast based on coming alone to our live podcast. But don't be a direct competitor. But don't, please. We need all the sponsors. I will kill you like the gnat that just landed in my drink. Wow. We talk about a lot of random shit on the podcast and one of the uh, consistent topics that comes up is Devin Sawa. Devin Sawa <laughs> was one of my main crushes, obviously, as a youngster. JTT was number one, but right. Devin Sawa uh, like JTT, I thought was a t more attainable. <laughs> he was okay because he was short. He was closer to the ground. He was grounded. He was mainly TV, besides a couple movies. So I just thought he was e easier to access as an 11 year old living in North Carolina. <laughs> this is pre Twitter. This is all we had. But Devin Sawa was like this magical beast, and now he's grown up. He's a family man, and he's all over Twitter and Instagram, and he's really funny. We have found a very. Um, Sorry, I got a mosquito. Um... <laughs> My heart stopped beating. So anyway, Devin Sala has become someone that we have accidentally, not so accidentally, become more obsessed with and talk mm -hmm. about a lot to the point that he started liking Mamrie's tweets. We are really manifesting this human into our actual Truly. world. With that comes the speech impediment Sawa, the Siwa. <laughs> if Elmer Fudd had a crush on Devin Sawa, he was at Orban for Siwa. Orban for Siwa. Siwa. Another unicorn in the social media atmosphere that is fascinating to us. She is 16 and has the voice of, like, what's this? What's this? What's this? Like, what is I don't even know. <laughs> Old gay actor Harvey. <laughs> Harvey Weinstein? No. no. Harvey, no. Fi Harvey Weinstein. Weinstein. I thought it'd be a very fun video idea mm. to do Sawa or Siwa. I'm gonna show Mamrie very close up images of something and she has to tell me if this has come from Devin Sawa or Jojo, God, I, this is rubber this. baby buggy bumper or Jojo Siwa's Instagram. Sponsored by Wawa. Here's our first image. Oh my God, that looks like me. Siwa doesn't have her lips done and this clearly wouldn't be Devin Sawa's lips. Is it pictures of them or just pictures they posted? It's pictures they posted because Sawa, you will find, he loves a good meme. He does love a meme. I'm gonna say, this is someone posing with Jojo Siwa. You are correct, it's Trisha Paytas. Oh! Jason Nash and David Dobrik with Jojo Siwa. Nailed it. The caption is honestly like, wow, this is crazy lol. I found three new friends today. Fire emoji, I love these people. Today. This so checks out. Congrats, one for one. Next. Okay, now Devin, I call him Devin. Devin routinely posts his kids who are like really cute. Mm -hmm. And he has a really adorable little daughter. So I'm gonna say this is from Devin Sala's Instagram, it's a picture, it's like a Halloween photo or like a birthday theme photo from his kids. You are correct. Ah! It's a pinata 
and he goes, my three-year-old's birthday, so we hung a unicorn and beat the shit out of it with a closet rod. The Sawas. <laughs> He's the best. No truly. filter, truly no filter on this. Who's next? Oh my God, is it an Olive Garden breadstick? <laughs> no, I'm hungry. I think it's Jojo Siwa. <laughs> In the library <laughs> with a noose. <laughs> Truly, with a, looks like a candlestick. Siwa, final answer. It is Devin Sawa. Oh. It's his little girl's birthday I'm photo. And he wrote, kid. told her to close her eyes and really <laughs> concentrate on her wish. Look at that lip. I should have known that. I should have known. What even? <laughs> what even, Grace? What? What kind of close up is this? It looks like a little sea creature with eyeballs and a little pointy nose. Okay. Um, I'm gonna say it's, oh man. It's part of Jojo Siwa's Freddie Mercury costume since she had a queen themed 16th birthday and made everyone listen to her sing queen song. You're close, it is Elton John's <gasps> tit. Oh wait, uh, oh my god. <laughs> A mus uh, there was a musical legend in there somewhere. Uh, I love that Elton's titty looks like a sea creature. And they are both killing the glasses game. Okay. Oh, right. wow. Okay. Okay. I think this is a classic Devon Sawa meme. I think it's an animated picture. You are incorrect. No! It is the segue in which Jojo Siwa rides in her live show. It's called Bobo. <laughs> Hold on. What? Trust me, I had to watch video footage so I knew that this wasn't Photoshop. She rides out on a Segway? Yep, it's a Segway that's feathers all the way up and then this is on the front of it. This is not Photoshop, that's like a face. And she rides it all across the stage oh while she sings. <laughs> we have to go to this tour. Also, if I was Jojo Siwa and I was touring, I would name it Take a Bow. Like, Take a Bow. Mm. That's what I'd name my tour. Okay. What is our life? Next. I, I mean, don't truly know. grace hell big. Hold on, I don't know what this one is. Got it. Somewhere in here you've thrown in a Devon Sawa classic meme. So I'm gonna say it's a John Wick meme posted on Devon Sawa's account. You were correct a few minutes ago. It is oh! Jojo Siwa ah! singing with the Queen cover band, Queen Nation, the Queen tribute band. You know what I was doing at 16? Getting drunk. Drugs. <laughs> my mom find a handle of pop-off vodka in my trunk when we went Christmas shopping. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Uh, uh, Sawa. It's Devin Sawa complaining about gasoline prices. He's such a dad! A full dad, photo. Dad, where can we figure out where this is? I mean, it's, it's in Hollywood. Hollywood. <laughs> uh, Siwa, that's part of a costume. It's Sawa! Sawa's it's tattoo. part of his body costume! How did I not know this? The Look one at Casper. <laughs> his shoulder has a martini on it. Girl. Here we okay, go. that's uh, those are teeth on, I wouldn't put it past Devin Sawa to post an Ace Ventura meme. He absolutely has posted Jim Carrey on his Instagram. However, this is Kanye West with Jojo uh, Those are Kanye West teeth. Oh my God. And you know what? I bet North is a, and Penelope are obsessed with JoJo. Two more for you. I mean, this close up is ridiculous. <laughs> so, so You're right. It's, uh, it's a meme that he posted of Manson. <laughs> Marilyn Manson waiting for the birds to use my new bird feeders. Honestly, though, I got a new hummingbird feeder. Chip got us one, and I was just like waiting as well. Okay, last one. Obviously, with that kind of hot pink, it's a Sawa. To Siwa. I forgot which name. <laughs> it's a JoJo Siwa. It is incorrect. It is no! a Devin Sawa in the background with his son. I loved this post. You sent me this post uh, <laughs> on a DM on Instagram. I said, I don't know what to feel because he is extremely attractive and being a family man in this photo. If I was eight, I'd have a crush on the sun. Well, all right, let's, maybe, I think you passed the test. I don't know if there's any Thanks. grading curve on this at all. One, you guys should buy tickets to our live shows if you are in or around any of the available cities that we are doing it in. All the links will be in the description box below. And now go over to Mamie's channel because we are doing a video over there in which we talk about uh, celebrity writers. And other than that, listen to our podcast every Wednesday. This might get weird. And we have a Patreon. All the links are down below. It's really fun over there. I mean, I feel like I need to step up my Instagram game. <gasps> More L and boob. <laughs> <laughs> if you had to give like a log line for each one of them, people that don't know, Devin Sawa. Sawa is 90s heartthrob turned adult pussy throb. <laughs> and then Jojo Siwa is scared. <laughs> scared.